Hello everybody, welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. Today we're going to be doing the last piece of DLC that I have left to record for Dragon Age, which would be Witch Hunt. So at this point I'll be done with everything for Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age 2 once this is done. So we won't have anything else to do until Dragon Age 3 eventually comes out. So uh, let's go ahead and get into it. Now, I haven't decided how I'm going to play out the end of this exactly. Um, I won't really talk about it until we get there in case you haven't played through this before because I don't really want to spoil how it ends. But uh, basically we're going to go look for Morgan. So let's import our old warden. Um, which one of these is going to be the one that I want to import here? Level 34, that's probably my most recent one, isn't it? From Golems. Yeah, that must be from the end of the Golems of whatever you want to call it. Let's do that then. Now I don't remember the combat in this one being particularly hard, so hopefully it won't be as ridiculous as the end of the Golems of our... Armagarak, Armagarak were. I don't think it is. once told me that temptation lies in the forbidden. <coughs> Do not follow me, I said. Yet you search even so. Some doors should never be reopened. Now, I should probably say, for the most part, this made a lot more sense with my male warden because he was in love with her and stuff. I didn't record that. Um, so it doesn't make as much sense with this character why we're doing this. So I'll probably end up going... Um, didn't I name the dog Spot before? I think I did. Spot's a good name for a dog, especially because he doesn't have any spots. Anyway, um, there's not as much motivation for my character here to be following Morgan, but it works. I think I'm going to be doing this differently. My other character was motivated by, by love for Morgan, so I'll probably be more motivated by revenge. probably what I'm thinking. So let's check out what's going on inside. Oh, Anathar, you startled me. <coughs> of all the things to encounter in these wilds, I never expected one of our own. Have you news of the witch? Actually, I'd hoped Flemeth might help me. I am tracking her daughter, Morrigan. You have heard of her, no? She is a witch who has something that belongs to our people. And I came to recover it. And you? Has Morrigan wronged you as well? Um... Yeah, we'll kill her. It seems she has a penchant for we'll making enemies. We'll go with that route. Morrigan stole an ancient book my clan has guarded since the days of Arlathan. We were the only ones with such a piece of our history. Everything we once had, all legacy of our ancient magics, were stripped from us. First by the Tevinter Magisters, then by the Wretched Circle. And Morrigan took what little was left. Wow, what a jerk. This gives me a good reason to... For almost 2,000 years, yeah, the Dalish two. people have been wanderers. A shadow of what we once were. This book, as much of a mystery as it is to us, is one of the only clues on how to reclaim that past. My keeper, Solon, says it was a treatise on something the ancients called Alluvian. The word is as old as the book itself, and its meaning has been lost. Save perhaps to Morrigan. Help me. We both want Morrigan. And we can aid each other. The Book of Alluvian was reclaimed for my clan by an elven mage who stole it from the Circle of Magi before defecting. And still other treasures remain with the Circle. Have you any standing to request entrance? You said you were no longer with the people. No, I am a Grey Warden, Help yep. Me. We both want Morrigan, and we can aid each other. Um, you're saying something completely different They'll than... They'll have to let us in. Masiranas, let us go immediately. 
It's the first time that's happened to me in this entire game that somebody said something entirely different than what the subtitles and the animation were saying. Weird. Yeah, I removed the, them, their contents, didn't I? Is there nothing in here? Nope. Alright, let's get out of here. Yeah, if she's stealing uh, elven stuff, that gives this character motivation to actually do something about it, too, so that kind of works out. Whoa. What are you guys doing here? Oh, she's got two full size swords? That's ridiculous. Well, anyway, um, like I was saying, my male warden character. Um, he was in a romance with her and he did the the ritual and all that stuff. So it made sense for him to actually want to go along with her. But as far as this character goes, we kind of got screwed by Morgan, so... Might want to deal some revenge. In actuality, like I I really do have a thing for, um, for Claudia Black, so... I instantly liked Morgan anyway because of that when I was playing through this game because I just like her a lot. She's got a great voice. I think she's really great on Farscape and on uh, Stargate. Welcome to Ferelden's Circle of Magi. Please, keep your hound under control. Some of the apprentices are easily startled. And I see you have a Dalish elf with you. I am a Dalish elf. Is that a problem? What is that supposed to mean? Most Dalish are common thieves? As you say, the wow. Circle is glad to have you as a guest. As you can see, things are much changed from when you were last here. If you're looking for a book, you can start in the Index section. As the Warden Commander, you and your guests are free to explore the first floor of the tower without an escort. Good day to you. Alrighty. Why did the dog... I see why... I never assigned the stupid skills to the dog is the problem, isn't it? Keeper Solon did not want me to come No, here. he doesn't even have any skills. It is all what? too tempting to overturn the tight order of their little world. <coughs> Apparently that dog's just going to be saying that he needs to level up forever. Whatever. All done. Might as well snoop around while we're here, I guess, a little bit. Actually, we really might as well not. There's no reason to. I'm not going to find anything I need. This is the last DLC. We got what we need. Let's just get to it. And like I was saying, uh, that I character had very different motivations and stuff, so... Oh, all right. A little. You have to admit, it's tempting, right? Always make look at all these books. I've never seen so many. So, I don't know how that's going to play out with, uh with Dragon Age 3 or not, if they even import the saves or anything like that. I don't know what index I'm supposed to look at. What were we even looking for? A catalog, a catalog of Elven... This book is in the mysterious artifacts section. I don't remember this very well, to be honest. Um... Some of the titles for the books are pretty good. Where is the section that they're talking about? I'm sure it's probably listed with these little X's. But I'm just going to go look around. Mysterious artifacts. Here we go. Catalog of Elven Ruins. That sounds... Or of Elven... There. Yeah. I recognize the character on this page. I think it makes up part of the word Illuvian. I'm a warrior, not a scholar. This is a library, isn't it? Perhaps another book could help us translate this. Yeah, books and books and books. That's what everything's just getting thrown into books. Okay, so this is a lot like that other you puzzle. Out. You think you could sneak up on the mage over there? How high do you think he'd throw those things if he turned around and saw you looming over him? That's medicine stuff. It seems like it's gonna be easier to just look myself. So we need language stuff. Any of this language stuff? Hmm. Maybe. Maybe not. Doesn't look like it. Found the body of the Templar who went after those apostates near Hyde. There's like nothing here. 
Alright, let's just look at it. Um, yeah, that's not helpful. What about... See if any of that's helpful. It didn't seem that useful. It seemed like it was just telling me the sections to go so I didn't have to walk around looking, but... Well, he knows about runes, actually, doesn't he? 